All right, hey, what's up, everyone? I'll be the video here. Now, in this first uh, WB Dog tutorial video, I'm going to show you how you can install a block and how you can install the plugin and the templates that come with it. And the first thing that you need to do is download the zip file from the members area. Now, if you have the singles, if you purchase a single user license or the developer's user license or the pro version, uh, the installation process would be pretty much the same okay now once you download you would have a folder something like this now I have the pro version here but if you bought the singles it would say WB$3.0 single or WB$3.0 developer edition based on your purchase now I have the pro version here now if I open this there are a couple of files now this file WB$3.0 pro or WB$3.0 singles or developers based on your purchase would be the plugin all these files are the templates now in the pro version we have all the 12 templates and the singles version we would have just this template that would be the WBD 3 theme in the developers license we would have WBD 3 and 2 as well so 2 in the developers 1 in the singles and all 12 in pro so again if you want to upgrade just let us know and support this and we'll upgrade you now let's move on to installing a blog all right so the first thing that you need to do is log into the cPanel in your domain. I hope you know that. Next, just type quick and you should see quick install here. Just open quick install and we'll show you how to install a blog. I mean, just go ahead, click on WordPress over here under blog softwares. Click on continue. Select the domain where you want to install the blog or I'll just leave it just leave it uh, as blank or you can install it on a directory. I'm going to install it on a directory. Then blog one that's the director name you gotta enter an email I'm gonna just enter a dummy email for now blog title demo blog or you can just add whatever title you want whatever username you want I'm going to go with admin I a video all right okay so I'm gonna click on install and quick install will go ahead and install the blog for me all right Okay, great. So I have the blog installed now. If I want to log in, I'm just going to click on this link. I'm going to copy this password. Just click on this link real quick. And I'm going to go ahead and log in here. I'm going to paste my password and click on log. And that should take me inside. Now I can go ahead and change my password and whatever I want if I do that. Okay. Now the next thing that I want to do is install the plugin. Okay, so I'm gonna go to plugins, click on add new, and I'm gonna click on upload. This should get the plugin installed for me. I'm gonna click on choose files over here, and I'm gonna select WP Dollar Three Pro. Okay, and I'm gonna click on install now. Now depending on this. The license that you purchase, purchase the size of the file would vary from 1 MB to 1115 MB, right? So we have the pro version, so it's almost 12, 13 MB long. So it's gonna take a couple of minutes. Anyway, I'm gonna move over to a different blog so I can show you how uh, this would look. Now, once you have the plugin uploaded, it will show up here as WP3.0 Pro or Single or Developers. Just click on Activate to activate the plugin. And what this is going to do is this is going to make sure the plugin is properly installed and activated on your blog and you're ready to use it. All right, so we have the plugin here. You can see the plugin WP3.0 over here. Now I'm going to click on this. I'm going to walk you through all of these features and how to set them up in a couple of minutes in the next videos. First, I want to show you how the plugin actually looks like. So this is your dashboard where you can see all that. Uh, add campaigns that you're gonna create. This is a style uh, template where you can uh, customize the templates that you're using. This is the settings for all the SEO stuff. This is for the uh, for the review post campaigns that you create. This is ad builder where you can create all different kind of ads: the Amazon ads, uh, the Carousel ads, the in-text ads, the product ads, product review ad, recommended products. 
banner ads and the text ads right now this is where you can run the backlinker and create tons of backlinks for your post analytics is where you see analytics of uh, of how many clicks people have made and what kind of traffic you're getting and stuff like that and settings is where you set up your blog your affiliate ID and SQL key and everything I'm gonna walk you through all of those in a couple of minutes the next thing I want to tell you right now is how to install a WP doll theme all right so to install one of those just go to appearances and click on themes and once you're on this page click on add new just click on add new and then click on upload themes button over here now I'm gonna go to choose file and select one of the team just one either one if you want to install all 12 you'll have to do it one by one okay so I'm gonna go ahead and install the first template okay and click on install these templates are really small so they'll just take a couple of seconds to install and should be ready for you to use and one of the key things you know you need to keep in mind well uh, using a template that customizing the, the templates is pretty important and it's pretty easy with WP Daughter. So once you have installed the template, make sure you customize the color, the other options of the template to make it make sure it looks uh, the way you want it to look. Okay. And we have the plugin here, and, uh, the template here, and it's already activated because we just activated it. Okay. Let's see if there's anything out there. It should be a blank page right now because we don't have any post. If you want to customize, if you want to change the color, add a logo and stuff like that to the template, uh, you have to go to WP Dollar and go to Styles. This is where you can upload a logo, uh, change the featured category, change the color and everything. I'll walk you through uh, all of these in the next video. And also make sure you download the PDF that we have included here that shows you how uh, each of these options for styling for customizing the templates work. All right, so this is Abhi Dewey signing off. In the next video, I'm gonna show, talk you through setting up the plugin, the SEO parts, and then we'll go ahead with post campaigns and backlinks and analytics and ad builders and everything. All right, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us on our support desk.